1974, Tariq had been to prison twice, found the girl of his dreams, Nergis Tapal, immersed himself in the left-wing movement, and seen the start of the struggle for the liberation of Bangladesh. Now, look at Kashmir, the 370 article, article 35A, ये तमाम चीजें इंडियन कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन के अंदर थीं और ये क्लियरली पता था कि टेम्प्ररी प्रोविजन है पाकिस्तान में रहकर हमने लव 370 नहीं सुना था कभी आज ये जो लोग हैं मजॉरिटी यानी यानी 60 टू 70 परसेंट लोगों की जो लैंग्वेज है वो बोलने की इजाजत नहीं है भाई इंडिया के जो स्टेट ऑफ जम्मू कश्मीर है उसमें कश्मीरी जबान तो लोग बोलते हैं ना पाकिस्तान में कोई कश्मीरी जबान नहीं जानता ये सेल्फ इन्फ्लिक्टेड हुंड वाले लोग इंडिया को लेक्चर दे रहे हैं कि तुमने 370 पे क्या किया इट्स एन एब्सोल्यूट नॉनसेंस फॉर एनीवन आउटसाइड इंडिया टू गिव एडवाइस टू इंडियन आप सोचिए 1967 में मैं वहाँ आया था तो राइट फ्रॉम दैट टाइम अप टू अब चार साल गुजर गए काफी बंगाली स्टूडेंट्स के साथ और उनकी पहली दफा हमें समझ में आई कि व्हाट आर बंगाली एस्पिरेशंस कि कैसे बंगाल को पार्टीशन किया गया कैसे 1946 में कलकत्ता में हिंदुओं को मारने का बकायदा प्लान बनाया ताकि हिंदू और मुसलमान बंगाली एक साथ ना रह सके एक बंगलस्तान का भी आइडिया था ये वहीं क्योंकि उनके साथ थे तो समझ में आया जहर मैंने प्रॉब्लम्स के बाद मैंने मैंने देखा हमारे दोस्तों के घरों पे रहे बंगाली स्टूडेंट्स छुप के एंड वेरी ट्रॉमेटिक बट ये आप सोचिए कि उस समाने में ये तो दस महीने वॉर ऑफ लिब्रेशन चली ना पूरे देश की अप टू डिसम्बर सेवन Tenth, nineteen seventy one. War was from December third to December seventeen. लेकिन वॉर से पहले दस महीने मार्च से दिसंबर तक there was the Pakistan military about a hundred thousand soldiers slaughtering, raping women. Close to a hundred thousand women needed a UN help to get abortions after the war was over. This has been the only time that United Nations ne क्योंकि उन बच्चियों को ना उनके माँबाप रख रहे थे, ना वो पाकिस्तान जा सकती थीं। Many of these ill so-called illegitimate children were adopted by Americans, including Senator John McCain's daughter, who is a Bangladeshi. इन बच्चियों को rescue करके लड़कों को सब लेके जेल का। The world actually came one. But the Baloch immediately caught on that this is wrong. Yes. BSO होता था। Yes. Those students are wrong. Yes. Yes. I know the the Baloch and the Pathans. Yeah, yeah. Well, maybe yeah. not all of them. Yeah. They actually protected us. Yeah. Do you know? For, yeah. for the, I was there for nine months, eight yeah. months after that. And no, no, they protected they, us. Do you remember we had a pro Mukti Bahini rally in the university? Yes, I know. You were there. I, Amir was there. Amir was there. We were there. there. People were in state of shock. But we still had about yes. eight, nine hundred people who came out. Pakistan army should withdraw from East Pakistan. And we needed to keep a low profile because yeah. we were continuously being threatened by the Punjabi students. Mm -hmm. and, and the intelligence. And the, Pan and the Punjab well, okay. The police the Punjab yes, Punjab. they were there, but the Punjabi students actually decided one night they would beat us up. Mm -hmm. And just as they were, literally they were actually approaching the hostels, they were going to actually beat up the Bangladeshis because just around about that time the Mukti Mahini was becoming active and yeah. they were actually capturing Pakistani soldiers and yeah. officers and actually torturing oh. them to death. Oh. So these people felt that they needed to do something, some retribution. Oh. So they thought they'd pick on Bangladeshi students or the East Pakistani students were there. And we could actually see them coming just at that time. This is an amazing coincidence. You know, you remember the university buses, they would come from Guru Mandir. Yeah. Bus arrived full of Balochi students. Yeah. There were about 18, 20 of them. Yeah. There must have been at least 100 or 150 Punjabis. These guys came out and started chasing this 200, 150 people, and those people ran like hell yeah, I, towards you know, towards I the IBA. Oh, in the pharmacy department. And they just scattered, 
And the Baluchis came and told us, look, as long as we're here, nobody's going to touch you. Touch you. No, no, we we okay. felt very good that we were exposing the crimes of our own military. Mm -hmm. And in Karachi University, one thousand girls and girls were Nikla against the Pakistan military mm -hmm. and for Mukti Bahini. In, during the Bangladesh war, we were just a handful of people yes. who were very clear that Mukti Bahini was right. Yes. We supported EPSU, which is the East Pakistan Students Union, our equivalent over there. So what's uh, your take on the war? Why do you think that war happened? Uh, Pakistan ki tamam income jo thi, mm -hmm. foreign exchange, mm -hmm. Uh, reservoirs jo hote hain, jo har kehte hain ki kitne billion dollar mm -hmm. that came from East Pakistan. Why? Because East Pakistan produced 75% of the world's jute. Okay. It used to be called the golden fiber of Pakistan. Puri dunya mein ye gani bag jo hai, isse Pakistan se aata tha. It was exported across the world. Sabse pehle jab Korean war hui, aur uh, allied troops to American side ke the, mm -hmm. they didn't have supplies. Pakistan ki jo India pe ek dum economy shoot ki hai mm -hmm. in 1947-48 isme wo because of the Korean War. Mm -hmm. Uska payment America ne kaise ki F-86 jo inke jahaz the mm -hmm. after the Korean War ended wo Pakistan ko mil gaya. Ye jute jo hai iski income jari hai sari. Raul, right. uh, Karachi, pehle capital tha, okay. 1916 mein capital Karachi se bhi naya shehar banaya. Achha. Are you aware that there are no cities made in the last four five hundred years other than Islamabad wow. no, and probably that. Sao Paulo as well, mm -hmm. Brazil ka. Mm -hmm. Islamabad was, a, kya kya? was created for the army. Wow. There was so much money in Pakistan from Bangladesh's jute that the billions of dollars earned were shifted over there. Kaun apni, uh, uh, you know, the golden calf yeah, se kehte hain? Kaun jaane dega? To Islamabad pehle kiska part tha? Like Islamabad was kachra maidan. Oh. Rahul Pindi tha military ka headquarter. Right, right. British army ka headquarter. Uh, it was the headquarters of all of India's army. Mm -hmm. And uh, Islamabad was built about 40 kilometers to the northeast of that. A hill station in Rawalpindi ke Pass that's called Mari. Mm -hmm, Mari. It's on a height. For you, ki aunty, you can see that you can see that you can see that it's very, very hot. So, you can see that we have uncle, daddy, share it with you. This is the dirty civilians now. You can see that 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 you moved the army there and when Sheikh Mujib won mm -hmm. the right to be Prime Minister of Pakistan yeah. Yeah. they destroyed the country but they didn't want to give power to Sheikh Mujib mm. who by the way was imprisoned all that time in Pakistan mm -hmm. in Balochistan Bangaliyon ki tarah azadi maang mm -hmm. War, uh, 71 war officially was declared on December 3rd, 1971. Okay. Uh, the day Pakistan Air Force bombed Indian airfields and tried to repeat uh, what it did in 1965 mm -hmm. but failed, but that's irrelevant. Mm -hmm. December 3rd, 1971, kohi meri badi Farida ki or my brother-in-law Anis Khan ki shadi thi. Hmm. Ghar ke saamne wala meydan pe. Usi dini. Usi dini thi. Aur hume war ka is tarah pata chala ke humara ek, ek mamu navy mein thay, ek uh, military mein, uh, army mein thay. They had to suddenly okay. leave hmm. and we figured out ke garbar hai. Aur phir light hai bandhu gaya. Hmm. Aur phir humari bhen ki shadi mein degen jo thi, wo duti. Aur uh, baja is ke ke, oh meri maa ke rhi. Vekho, sara khana laya ke ja raha hai, neko rukda nahi hai. Oh my God. Yeah, yeah. Apni okay. or I lived in the northern furthest point of Nazmabad and my newspaper office was near the uh, port mm -hmm. uh, Bandar Road right, right. Bandar meaning right. port yeah. I went to that 
and i was i remember i was alone on the road there was no traffic and my only feeling was i can even go on the other side <laughs> it's mm-hmm. nothing but i reached the office and i went up there was staff there uh my editor at that time uh, farooq mazhar god bless his soul wonderful guy mm-hmm. unne kehte ri mat mari what, what are you here for i said war hui sir chhat pe chal ke dekhte <laughs> i'm not exaggerating please are you acha chal acha ye log sab baithe hue the editors uh, on the ground floor garage ke paas jahan uh, the newspaper had gone from print but first issue jab aate hain right. so you know चक्कर ये वहाँ बैठे हुए थे मैं सर इधर से कुछ नहीं नजर आएगा छत से चल के देखते देर वॉज अ फायर बॉल दैट आई सो इट वॉज लाइक अ वर्ल्केनो है नॉट टू फार अवे एंड नो 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 नथिंग इट वॉज जस्ट समथिंग जस्ट वेन बूम एंड बॉल ऑफ फायर रोज वे अप एंड फ्लेम्स कमिंग आउट and uh, uh kya kehte hain curiosity kills the yeah. cat, cat or yeah. the yeah. industry is great yeah. <laughs> we were suckers for punishment main aur hamara wohi dost sabid mm-hmm. ali unne ka partner se dekh ke aate kya hua motorcycle pe baithe and we went towards where this uh, it was on the port later on we learned that the indians had osa missile boats that were hidden off the coast mm-hmm. uh, these are russian uh, made uh, land to land missile boats जो वॉर डिक्लेयर होती थी एंटर द कराची हार्बर ब्लू अप द फ्यूल डम्प्स सैंक टू फ्रिगेट्स एंड वेंट अवे वेन वी केम बैक आफ्टर कपल ऑफ आवर्स बैक टू माई मोटरसाइकिल माई मोटर बाइक हैड संक अबाउट थ्री इंचज इन टू द रोड द हीट वॉज दैट मच दैट द टार इट हैड गॉन इन एंड वी हैड टू पुल द मोटर बाइक आउट एंड वी न्यू that this was no longer a game right later the next day we found out pakistan had no fire fighting equipment that our ships had been destroyed karachi port was dead mm-hmm. on day 1 of the war which essentially meant pakistan did not have a port mm-hmm. pakistan ne ek apni submarine bheji thi wo zaka patnam mein vikrant ko dubane ke liye wo submarine डूब गई विथ इट्स इंटायर क्रू आउटसाइड सेवेंटी वन की वॉर में द लैंड नॉट पैनिक सो दे वॉज बम्बार्डमेंट बाई इंडियन जेट्स ऑन कराची दिस कावर्ड टेल्स मी हम नीचे आएंगे आप ऊपर वाला हमारा घर ले रहे अरे आई वेंट अप टू बेडरूम पर आए मैं नर्गिस का फोन के तार से बैठे दे लिव इन दैट रूम द होल फैमिली थ्रू आउट द वॉर या बिकॉज दिस इज इफ दिस हाउस इज बॉन्ग a tenant should die this is bizarre logic so they all live i am living like a princely bench in a television tight tight car free children sab wo niche baithe you for one day wo putti thi na mm-hmm. you go to the terrace oh, we, there's a dog fight let's go up to watch this they go to the roof there's a dog fight going on yeah, yeah. the jets in the air yes, and yes. suddenly one plane came the house was near guru mandir oh no it yeah. went boom अजीब लोग थे हम लोग यार लोग बाहर छुप रहे हम लोग छत पे जा रहे नो वी वी वर ऑन आमिर टेरेस ऑल नाइट स्मोकिंग एंड वाचिंग द ऑयल डंप बर्न रिमेंबर द बर्न या के मार यू नो द बम बम द ऑयल टर्मिनल इट बर्न फॉर 3 डेज हां वॉर के जमाने में हम इस बहाने हम पता था कोई बाहर तो है नहीं तो आई वुड टेक गो ऑन मोटरसाइकिल एंड you know exchange glances <laughs> from her wo wo malai ko chhod wow i'm just crazy stupid times <laughs> ye chhat pe baithi jiske bole wah in a state of war where the cities are being bombed i'm asking her to go ke chhat pe na mera aate mein i don't know why men do that chhat pe khada na main wahan se guzrunga